I am here to do a somewhat informative answer type of video. I recorded a video like this when I was just newly a vegetarian, but I wanted to go ahead and do just an updated version because that quality was not good. Not good. I'm just going to answer these questions in regards to what vegetarians get asked all the time. And I don't speak for the whole vegetarian community. I am speaking for myself. So these are my opinions. So as many of you guys know, if you guys have been subscribed to my channel for a while, I have been a vegetarian since about December 2013. I became a vegetarian on accident. I only wanted to give it a try for about a month. And then the one month turned into two, then into six, then to a year. And then I believe the end of this year will be five years. All right, so let's get right into the questions. Beans, tofu, lentils, nuts. There's so many other places to get proteins besides red meat, but my personal is tofu and beans. I don't necessarily like beans and I never really liked them, but you know, I didn't like mushrooms before, but I had to sort of learn how to like them because it's one of the, the couple of things that I can eat. <laughs> Anything without meat? Uh, <laughs> I do still eat cheese and eggs for the most part right now, for now. I've weaned off of milk. I am actually trying to get more almond milk with things. I stopped buying regular milk, only almond milk. So yeah, I've weaned off of that. So we'll see. I feel like I haven't found a cheese that is a good substitute yet, but we'll see. <laughs> actually, no, it's not. It's actually pretty cool to find places here and there that cater and have a special menu for vegetarians or vegans or you know people with different eating lifestyles as I like to call it but I mean honestly it's it's not much different than eating regular we just don't have meat so I can have the pasta that you're having but just not have meat in it I can have lasagna but just not have meat in it I can have salad without the meat in it and when all else fails I just add potatoes to everything so times when like someone's eating like these chicken I know this sounds horrible but when people are eating like this like these chicken wings or like they're like I don't know just chicken like fried chicken like if you guys don't know this when I was in eighth grade I decided to stop eating hamburger and I tried to give up as much red meat as possible so my transition from what I ate regularly to vegetarianism wasn't that much drastic I pretty much just gave up chicken and fish sometimes when I you know when chicken just looks really good God, that sounds horrible I'm a horrible person I'm a horrible vegetarian <laughs> yeah that's the plan maybe possibly give veganism a try but I, I like I said I love cheese too much so I, I don't know if that's in my future yet but I mean I never said that I would become a vegetarian so who knows <laughs> contrary to popular belief no there are so many other meat options available now it's crazy really like common meat substitute for chicken is jackfruit which I've had a barbecue chicken uh, burger which is made out of jackfruit and seriously okay for someone who eats chicken on the regular, probably you know and taste the difference and you'd much rather have a chicken sandwich, whatever. But for someone who hasn't had chicken in almost five years, it's as good as it can get, right? And honestly, there are so many vegan places that have like meat substitutes that are pretty much like the real thing, like almost to the point where I don't want to eat it because it looks so real. Tofu's still there. I still make tofu subi, which is like musubi, but with tofu. And I really like it like a lot. Options now are endless when it comes to being vegan or vegetarian at restaurants and grocery stores. So I mean, tofu's always there though. So. <laughs> I touched on this earlier. I'm slowly transitioning to almond milk and I haven't had milk in a while because even Starbucks offers almond milk now. So when I do drink something there, which by the way, right now, <coughs> the ice cinnamon almond milk macchiato, bomb delio. So seriously, do yourself a favor, try it out. 
so I get this a lot. When I say I'm a vegetarian, I don't eat meat. If I ate fish and only fish, I would be a pescatarian, which I have tried long before this when I gave up meat for Lent, which is the 40 day being a Catholic before Easter type of thing. Yeah. My mom's to this day, she's like, oh, I made you salmon. I'm like, oh, I don't eat that. And then my dad has to tell her, yeah, she doesn't eat anything with eyes or that had a mother. <laughs> there are a lot of reasons why. The main reason for me is because I love animals. <laughs> um, uh, to put it simply, I have seen more than my fair share of videos online. And I know, I know, I know can't really trust things that are out there but honestly with how much meat we consume as a society it's crazy what we do to keep up with that volume and how we treat the animals and I always imagine the animals as human beings and it's so it's just so sad like like really sad like um okay I'm not gonna get emotional because I'm not but yeah it's just really sad and uh it's just one thing that I can help with. To produce and to keep up with the demand of meat, it's taking a toll on the environment as far as like factories where they have, where they slaughter animals and all that. And, uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so animals, the environment, and just, I feel better. I feel like I, I'm healthier. I mean, being vegetarian doesn't mean you're gonna lose weight doesn't mean that whatever but less red meat for me and not that i even ate red meat before yeah so and again you guys i am not trying to push my lifestyle on anyone i just wanted to go ahead and put it out there why i'm a vegetarian answer a couple questions if you guys had any questions in regards to being vegetarian and whatnot go ahead and comment down below yeah so simple as that all right, well, I hope you guys like these type of informational question answering videos. If you guys do, go and give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos by me, click the red subscribe button. It would totally make my day, and I will see you guys later.